Alright, I've got an article here from .esports.com. Grand Theft Auto 4 Red Dead Redemption Remaster is reportedly abandoned. Basically, um, they had supposedly, there's the rumor stating that they were, gonna, that they were remaking Grand Theft Auto 4 Red Dead Redemption, but they're no longer happening, according to an insider. Test 2 has been known to report accurate information regarding Grand Theft Auto, tweeted that while the remaster seemed like they were progressing a few years ago, they were ultimately scrapped. Here's his tweet. He says that uh, the poor reception of the trilogy definitive edition might be a reason behind that decision, which I could absolutely see that being the case. It mentions here that uh, despite selling more than 10 million copies, Rockstar botched their release with multiple technical issues. Now, I haven't played the definitive edition. I never bought it because I didn't want to, quite frankly, I didn't want to just, you know, give them even more money than they already have. But also, I'd heard about the multiple technical issues. Now, I've heard that they've patched them up, and for the most part, most of them are, are taken care of. There might there might be a few smaller ones here and there. I'm not really sure, to be quite honest. I'd rather just play the originals, you know, get some mods for them, and there we go. But anyway, anyway that's neither here nor there. Take 2 had also mentioned in May, through its uh, quarter 4 2022 earnings report that Grand Theft Auto 5 has now sold more than 165 million units. The company also spoke about the game making a billion dollars in overall retail sales, called the best selling game of the past 10 years in the US based on both unit and dollar sales. No surprise there. The game's fucking selling like crazy. That's the end of the article. But, uh, you know, like I said, here's the, uh, the original tweet. I, I could absolutely see it. It sold really well. But, it, the, you know, critics were not kind. And they might be looking at, well, what do we want to do? How do we want to handle this? Do we want to have the same place to handle these remasters? Or would we rather have someone else do them? Do we even want to come out with them? We're making so much money off of Grand Theft Auto V. It's ridiculous. I, some people have been saying that it's they're going to be concentrating more on Grand Theft Auto VI, which obviously, of course, I mean, they've been working on that game for a long, long time. But, you know, anyway, it's neither here nor there, I suppose. In, in the grand scheme, these remasters are probably not being moved forward with because just there's more money to be made with your shark cards and bullshit like that in Grand Theft Auto V. It's unfortunate. It's, it sucks, to be quite honest. Because, like, if they did some and they actually handled these games well, they handled the ports and stuff well, the remasters or whatever. Because they could do, you can get a company to do a really good job. But, you know, I don't know. I mean,. You know, Grand Theft Auto 4 is a, a much more recent game than these other games. So it would, I don't think it would have as many problems. But at the same time, maybe it would. I don't know. It's hard to say. Anyway, I just think it's unfortunate. Like, I know some people will get tired of the remasters and remakes. Of course, my opinion is always the same. You know, you don't have to buy it. I mean, if you don't like it, you don't have to buy it. But for people that want to buy it, they should be able to. That'd be cool. But anyway, I'll go ahead and wrap this up here. I've already gone three minutes on this, which is probably a little bit longer than it really deserves because the stuff wasn't announced. These remakes were just expected, but never announced. I, I, I am a little surprised that they aren't moving forward with the Red Dead Redemption uh, remaster because that game has kind of... It, like, there's a lot of people... I, like, I, I love the original Red Dead Redemption. You know, Red Dead Auto 4, it, it was good, but there was parts of the story I just didn't care for, and then some of the bullshit with like, hey, you gotta keep up your relationships with these people and stuff, I didn't care for that. But Red Dead Redemption 1, I love that game. But still, to this day, I love it. But anyway, next time, I'll go ahead and wrap this up here. Thank you very much for watching, and have a good one.